Job chapter 16. Job's fourth reply. Then Job answered and said. I have heard this sort of thing many times. Troublesome comforters, all of you. Is there no end to windy words? What sickness makes you rattle on? I also could talk as you do. Were you in my place? I could declaim over you. Or wag my head at you. I could strengthen you with talk. With mere chatter give relief. If I speak, my pain is not relieved. If I stop speaking, nothing changes. But now he has exhausted me. You have stunned all my companions. You asterisk have shriveled me up, it is a witness. My gauntness rises up to testify against me. His wrath tears and assails me. He gnashes his teeth against me. My enemy looks daggers at me. They gape at me with their mouths. They strike me on the cheek with insults. They are all enlisted against me. God has given me over to the impious. Into the hands of the wicked he has cast me. I was in peace, but he dislodged me. Seized me by the neck, dashed me to pieces. He has set me up for a target. His arrows strike me from all directions. He pierces my sides without mercy. Pours out my gall upon the ground. He pierces me, thrust upon thrust. Rushes at me like a warrior. I have sewn sackcloth on my skin. Laid my horn low in the dust. My face is inflamed with weeping. Darkness covers my eyes. Although my hands are free from violence. And my prayer sincere. O earth, do not cover my blood. Nor let my outcry come to rest. Even now my witness is in heaven. My advocate is on high. My friends it is who wrong me. Before God my eyes shed tears. That justice may be done for a mortal with God. As for a man with his neighbor. For my years are numbered. And I go the road of no return.